All right, welcome back. Well, the NCAA announced the field of 64 for the women's tournament this afternoon, and all the teams across the country had all these watch parties in place. But there was a small problem. The bracket was leaked, so ESPN moved up their selection show two hours ahead of schedule. So by the time the show was supposed to air, everyone already knew who they're going to play, including the Mercer Bears. So tonight they held a celebration instead of a watch party, reflecting on this past season and their second trip to the big dance. So who are the Bears playing? Mercer enters attorney as the number 15 seed. We'll have to take a flight up north to play the number two seed, Iowa. Here's head coach Susie Gardner on what it was like finding out their destination just a little earlier than they were expecting. Unfortunately, some of our players already knew from social media who we were playing, and I am very adamant about not knowing, so I made sure do not tell me, do not tell me. Um, so that kind of made it anticlimactic for the kids, but at the same time, I mean, we're still playing in March, and uh, it's still the NCAA tournament. But what's, what's great about Mercer fans is that even if some of the people know uh, the results of the, of the bracket, they're still here right now, and they, and they still want to celebrate with our players and, and hug their necks and tell them what a great job that they've done this year. And, and, and most of the uh, fans will not get to go to Iowa, I'm certain, uh, unlike last year. But, you know, they can at least send us out on our way uh, tonight and maybe on Wednesday. All right, Mercer and Iowa will face off on Friday at 2 o'clock in Iowa City. We will keep you updated with their progress. Don't forget, March Madness is all about filling out a bracket. And you at home can now fill one out as well and compete with all of us here at 13WMAZ. Just go to our website to join the Bracket Challenge.